So as a dual chamber system, we um, we used it now for a few races already. Have been quite successful with it. Um, we started the whole development already quite a while before, but it actually came to public in February. You probably have seen it on the web, and we released it a little bit. Uh, in general, about how it's it's built up. Um, you have a high pressure chamber which sits inside, like protecting the rim from get, getting impact. So. Uh, basically this reduces the uh, tension or the pressure on the rims and you have uh, a low pressure chamber which is just yeah, the normal tire chamber and you can inflate that to the pressure that you want to ride. Um, yeah, as I said we have been quite successful recently. We um, had Nicolau on the system at the end race, race uh, two weeks ago in Emelisen at Tweedler Festival and he won that race uh, which was a big success for us. Um, and just the next weekend, like last weekend, Emily Rago won the women's uh, race in um, for William. Actually, was the only girl out of the top four riders who didn't flat it, and she was on the system, which was also very good for us. Um, and a little bit later that day, Sam Hill got second on the system, which was also a really uh, great success. Well, basically, all the riders are using tubeless systems right now, but. Is this special systems? There are just a very few riders who are actually on it, so uh, you probably see them when they have two valves in the rim. <laughs> it's easy to spot. Um, well, definitely Sam Hill is on the system again here, also for uh, Leo Gang, and, and he will try the system. Uh, like, will try the system again here, and, and yeah, hopefully he can maybe win the race. But you should also have a look on Stevie Smith because uh, he's he's coming back he's very strong he was strong for William after his injury um, so yeah so they're just a very few riders and just keep your eyes open